this hair. This is the Abin Cosmetic Case. And made in the USA, made in Spain. And the interior is like a plastic type of material. It's wipeable, so if you spill anything, you can get it out. Show you them. And this. And this is the like. So that's my cosmetic case. Next, I have my business car holder. I use this primarily to hold my store cards. And this is in the vernis leather and the amarant. This one also made in Spain. And it comes with a pocket here and a pocket here. So this is that one. Next I have my vernis palme color. I love this wallet. This is a zippy wallet. That is the zipper pull. And it zips all around. Inside, it looks like this. So you have four cards here, four cards here. You have a space behind here for things. Here, space in here, here, here. And you have space for coins. Very spacious wallet. I love the zippy. And I'll show you close up of the color and the LV symbols. Okay. Next, I have my white multicolor key for key holder. There we go. And last time, my other camera, when I got it heat stamped, you guys couldn't see it. But now you can see it very nicely. I got the heat stamp in the blue. This was made in France. Here. And I'm able to hold my car key, my house key, and my mailbox key. So... If you guys are interested in finding it, interested in knowing if you can fit this inside, yes you can. If you have a key that's similar to mine. And it closes and it is not too bulky. Next I have my coin purse. And I have so many coins, coins in here. You see how much you can hold. You can hold a lot of coins. It come with a a little clip so you can clip it onto your bag, your D-ring. I love this thing. It's it's very practical, guys. And that is the zipper pull on it. And there we go. So this is my key holder. Next, we have my agenda. I've done a review on this, so if you're interested in finding out more about the Louis Vuitton small six ring agenda, check out my video. I go into details. Next, I have my Kusama cosmetic case, and I haven't used this yet. Go figure. I guess I just been lazy. Maybe I'll switch it out now. But this is the Kusama. See the details here. And I'm going to be doing a review on the cosmetic case. So stay tuned for that. So that is, this is my limited edition Kusama cosmetic case. Next I have my mini pouchette in the Azure print. And this one was made in France. 
this is so practical guys you can't hold a lot in it but when you just want to run errands I use this quite often inside is just plain opening like that very practical little bag and it's great if you want to hold things inside of your bigger bags you can this can be used as like a catch-all type of bag Next, we have my, my um, limited edition Kusama agenda in green. And I showed you guys this when I did my unboxing. Made in Spain, and she signed it here. And this is the Kusama paper. Where are the stickers? So this starts in January, so I'll start using it in January. It's it's identical to my monogram. Okay. Next, I have my Mila clutch in the white multicolor, and it comes with a plate here. The plate is identical to the plate that you will find on the monogram Eva and just check out some of the details I really like this bag I'm just I just really can't carry a lot in there the colors are really really pretty the color combination it's a very thin bag clutch as you can see it's very thin inside is the multi it's the Inside you have the raspberry microfiber and you have the little clutch here and it says Louis Vuitton here. You can clip it. Right here. Or you can just use it as a clutch. So that is the Mila clutch. I have my Emily wallet and I have it in the red a lot of people um, have problems with the button peeling but I've had this for over a year and a half I have something white on it I'll get that off over a year and a half and I have not had any problems with that button at all and I used it a year straight comes with a big pocket here pocket here here and you get four four card slots and I have had a heat stamp and these pull is just a leather piece you can put some coins in here so this is my Emily wallet in red my one and only charm you guys have seen this in my review so if you want more information or you want to see more details, go ahead and check that out. So this is my Posh Charm. I have two bandos. I have the black multicolor bando. And I featured this in a reveal video. And then I have my Steven Sprouse leopard bando I just love this one and it's actually thicker as you guys can see a little thicker than the multicolor one and then I have my stall you guys have seen I featured this in a video and show you it has the the pink smell like my perfume <laughs> and I haven't even worn this but I was about to and decided not to but it has my perfume on it, it has the pink Louis Vuitton this is so beautiful the weather is changing here in Texas so I'm going to start wearing this pretty soon. 
So this is my stall. And if you guys want to see the full, how big it is and all of that, check out my video. I have that video up as well. Bean shoes. I have worn these. Here they go. You can see the back. I'm going to do a video on these shoes. I've worn these a few times. And I want to tell you guys what I think about them. So, that's that. So these are my Valentine flats, and they're in the Ebene print. Last piece, I think I've come to the end, guys. I know you're tired, and I'm tired okay. too. My pouchette. And this was the first bag that I ever purchased. But this is not the one that I purchased. That one is long gone. And I will tell you that story. But this is a new one. And one thing I really hate about this one, it's like so paper thin. The canvas has definitely changed. I bought this this year. And the canvas has changed from before. Even when I look at my speedies from two years ago, look how thin this is. You see that? It's really sad. So yeah, guys, if you want to know why I don't have my first ever Louis Vuitton bag, please watch that videos for all the details. It's a shocker. This is that. Some details of it. The handles. This one here. was made in Spain show you some so this is the monogram okay guys so there you have it that is every single piece of Louis Vuitton that I own you have seen it all. I was so happy to share that with you guys. I hope you like it. If you like this video, thumbs it up. Leave me some comments. I love reading all you guys' comments. I love replying to you guys. So until the next video, guys, you enjoy your day, and I'll check you out next time. Bye-bye.